And a lot of that first year was creating a lot of content that mm-hmm. almost nobody, it felt like almost nobody paid attention to. For me, like my platform was YouTube. So it was like, I would put out a video once a week on YouTube and it was like, no one was paying attention. And then year two, suddenly like, like a lot of those videos started like picking up. And so I made $75,000, I think my second year and I got from better coaching. at everything. I was like, yeah, from, from coaching. And I got better at everything. It was like everything got 1% better because I was like, okay, I'm better at copywriting. I've like learned a little bit more about how to do these emails. This content is starting to pick up. Like, like now I've got like people coming in every day from these YouTube videos that many of which that I published like a year ago, I've gotten better at recording these things. I had launched like a couple offers that had had flopped and I finally like understood. I was like, okay, well, here's kind of what my audience wants. Oh, let me like survey them to like figure out what they want before I launch the next offer. So I'm not just like throwing random things out into the void, but I actually have some intention around what I'm creating. Yeah. And, um, and I'd also built trust. I mean, so much of, so much of the act of marketing, I really see marketing as nothing more than like, it's a human journey of building relationships and connections. Mm -hmm. And that stuff doesn't happen for the most part overnight. Catch all the episodes at theprofitablecoach.com or your favorite podcast player.